At a time when the global youth is striving for modernity, a group of young Iraqis are saving the tradition. They row a flotilla of traditional wooden boats, celebrating an ancient nautical heritage in the now drought-stricken country. The debate over modern things versus traditional ones, mechanization versus human labor, art versus science has been going on for long now. A similar battle is being fought by artists in the capital city of Iraq, where they are working to preserve an ancient nautical tradition of using wooden boats. Once a common site in Tigris and Euphrates, the birthplace of ancient civilizations, these traditional boats called as Mashouf are now on the verge of extinction. They are being rapidly replaced by motorized vessels. Now all these boats are motorized, which created a disconnection between you and the environment. It's like driving a taxi. I'm talking about a sort of a, I can say a spiritual connection, because it's not only limited to the aesthetic aspect, it creates a sense of familiarity. One such man is Rashad Salim, a painter, sculptor and eco-artist, with a penchant for preserving age-old tradition. He's been working to restore this tradition to its former glory. He co-founded Safina Projects, which aims to revive Iraq's traditional boating culture. Some five years ago, the 62-year-old started placing orders for construction of these boats. In order to save the dying craft, he went a step by involving youth in the task. He created teams with the help of nautical clubs that could teach youngsters on how to use these vessels. Even books about Venice's gondolas likened them to our mushroof in the first paragraph. So to me, its extinction is like the extinction of an essential facet of our civilization, which has existed for four or five millennia. These boats have existed throughout this time in one form or another. But with Iraq experiencing frequent droughts due to climate change, water bodies suffering due to pollution, and rising salinity, the technological advancement taking place unabated, it seems like a daunting task. <laughs> 